Hey, it's Ron, Ron's Wood Turner. Welcome back. Uh, I got a little project here in my shop. Uh, I'm going to turn this piece of pecan I got chucked up on here. I got it between centers. And I'm going to make a vase out of it, but it's going to be kind of weird because I'm going to paint it black. Gloss. Because I'm going to try that string pull thing that Wayne the wood turner did and just see what it looks like on the vase. If it all look good, I'll peel it back off and start over. So stick with me, we're going to try an experiment. Alright, so like I said, I chucked it between centers. It's on the spur drive here. And I took a forcer bit and made a little flat spot back here because it's riding on all four claws now. So it'll be less likely to slip while I'm turning it. And I tested it. I can get 600 RPMs really easy. And I hit it a few times with this roughing gouge. And it cuts pretty good. It's pecan. So I'm going to get it round and then we'll go from there. saw that. <laughs> it'll be very deep though so it'll be alright. Yeah, so I'm just going to keep roughing it. Get it. I'm just want a basic shape. Nothing fancy because really my experiment is to try that string pull thing on it and see if I can make that flower loopy looking things on it. Yeah, it might work, it might not. Like I said, if it don't I'll peel it off and make it wood. myself in a position where my, my chucks is big around as this is so I might have to cut it off. I'm going to make this the bottom right here. I'm not really worried about how tall the vise is. I'm just experiments about what the string will do to it. So I'm going to continue to shape this out and I got this big cavity right here but I'm going to go way past that and it doesn't crack into here so I'm good. I got a wormhole and another wormhole here. So, goodbye worms. sand it all down, get it nice and smooth, and then paint it. Because I'm going to try that trick on the outside before I bother hollering the inside. If it don't work, then this would be a pretty ugly vase. 
do, let's try it. Let me get it all sanded up for you. Alright, that's 400. And I'm not even going to waste my paste on here. I'm just going to hit it with some sanding sealer and, and then sand it back smooth and paint it. Alright, just a little paint. It's going to take a few coats to get it gloss. But that's what I'm doing. Well, I know. It's wood. It don't bleed. It don't need to be black. <laughs> it's an experiment. Give me, cut me some slack. Now right, I'll put. Okay. I got two coats on it now, and I'm gonna let it completely dry. Uh, Wayne the wood turner I guess he's in Scotland he sounded like he got a Scotland accident but he did this on a flat surface and it was so cool and I got to looking up string art and there's a bunch of people doing it I wanted to try it on this curved surface and uh, it may just not work but we're gonna find out so what I got is some uh, Josonja, it's iridescent. This one's gold, and this one is turquoise. Now, when they come out, they're white, so you got to make sure you mark your cup or whatever. I got them in a clear cup, so I just put a G on this one and a T on the other one. That way, I'll know which one is which, and uh, we'll see what happens. I got to let it dry. Alright, so what I did is I put, you can see it's white, <laughs> but it's really gold. Uh, I put some in there, and then I used some of this Liquitex. I added about five or six drops in there to try to keep it, I didn't want it too thick, and I didn't want it too thin, so it's easy to move around, so I think that might be it. And then all I got is a regular old cheap shoestring. And I'm going to squish it down in there and let it suck up all that paint it can. And then I'm going to try it. So <laughs> here we go. So let me get it in there and I'll, I'll pop back in whenever I put it on the uh, piece. Because i got to reposition the camera. Alright, so I don't know if you can see, but anyway, I just wallowed that shoestring around in there until I got a good coat of paint on it. <laughs> and I think I got enough paint on it. I don't know. We'll find out. So, hope I didn't tie it in a knot. <laughs> Let me get it back over here. Alright. Dang, I hope I can see that. Alright, so I'm going to take it out. tedious all right wish me luck well I call that a flop <laughs> string is too stiff 
So I'm going to wipe that off and try it again. Okay, so I repainted it, let it dry, <laughs> and I'm going for number two attempt with a different kind of string. So now I got regular old twine come on Tad come on there we go now, this is a lot flimsier string and uh, a lot stickier so let's see Alright, now, cross your fingers. Fail again. Uh, uh, maybe this can't be done. All right. Well, it didn't work. I'm gonna try something else. Okay. So I sanded it down and repainted it because I tried pulling the string uphill and it wouldn't do it. But I watched uh, Wayne the Woodturner again, and he did the fat side and went this way. So I think I might be able to do it this way. I'm going to try it. If not, I'll just sand it all off and make a regular old plain old wood vase out of it. So let's try that. See what happens. Let me get a better picture in there. There. All right. So I'm going to try this. It's cotton string, and it's pretty flexible. So I think once I get it coated with paint, it might work. If it don't, I'll do it again. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this. So let me, uh, let me mix up the paint. Okay. So I found my wife brought me some. I don't know, super thin stuff, and I got it coated in paint. So let's do it. And then <laughs> it looked pretty cool. I like that. Let me put a few more on there. Let me go reload my string. is reloaded. Let's do another one. Let's do it like this. Just go wrap it around. Go up. Go around. Hold it down and pull. Let it drag. Yes! That's cool. I went with turquoise. So I got room for two more. And I'll be back. <laughs> well, 
That one didn't look too cool. Well, I'm just playing anyway, whatever. I don't like, I don't like that one. Oh well, we'll see how it works out when it dries. I'll clean it up a little bit before it dries. Nah, whatever. We'll let that dry. That ain't too bad. <laughs> okay, <laughs> it, it, it can it can be better, but it was fun. At least I'm having fun with it. Uh oh, get some of this. Yeah. All right. We'll call on that. Alright. Cool mess. Alright, well let's dry it up. And I'm not real happy with it. I mean it's different. <laughs> but but it was fun. It whooped my butt. I had to start over, but it was a fun day in the shop, and I had a good time, so I really can't complain. It's almost Christmas, and y'all have a very Merry Christmas and a great day.